So, I did one of my favorite things today. Got out on the road, let the wind blow through my hair. So yeah, and I hit a rag store. I found something I had been wanting to add to the collection. You wanna know what it is? Meet me on the other side of this intro and we're going to get right into it. See you in just one second. What's going on everybody? It is your boy Trey Sent. I'm not going to keep you long because my battery is bombed out and depleted. Listen, it's your boy Trey Sent. Thank you all for returning to the scene of the crime. Before we even get into this, you know I need a few things from you. I need you to like, share, and sub. So what I got for you today is, got out, hit the rack stores up, had a pretty good little find. Tell it's been there a while because the box is also bombed out and depleted. But from the house of Calvin Klein, it is Eternity's EDP. The EDP, and this, as you see, the price they marked it down. It started out at sixty dollars, and they marked it down to forty-four dollars, and they marked it down to thirty-five dollars. I tried to get them to take something off because the box was so bombed out and depleted. But the lady looked at me and said, "You know, it's already been marked down twice." I'm thinking. I could have taken some out because this box is ragged, but she did. So what we're going to do here is we are going to smell this oh, nice mercy. for the first time. And what this is is a gift set, and it comes with. Make sure these are both forms. Yeah, it comes with a hundred mil and a thirty mil. Not sure which one of these I'm going to keep. I'm sure I'll be selling one of them. I'm not sure if it's going to be thirty mil and sell the 100 or vice versa. But for video sakes and for easeability, we are going to start with the 30 mil. I'm gonna sit that down there. Now this is a first impression. Um, and again, I went about less than two hours away from home, about around the Birmingham area, a little town called Gardendale, which is not really a little town anymore. But they have nice restaurants, nice little uh, TJ Maxx there that I always find some always find something at that TJ Maxx so um, and it's not hard to get to it's just you know honestly it's almost like two left turn two right turns from my house to be honest just an hour and a half of the highway but that's literally all I make is two right turns literally but that's a lot I make and then I ride for about an hour and 15 minutes and then I make a right turn and I'm like yeah like literally do right turns and left turns. But anyway, it's not here, not there. This is a first impression for me. Calvin Klein's Eternity for Men, EDP. Now I'm a huge fan of Calvin Klein, Eternity, the EDT. And let's see what the EDP brings. So I think they have this in. get a little bit of that same green vibe, that same green effect that you get from the original. But I'll say this off the top, Calvin Klein did a good job with this one in making it uh, similar to the EDT, but at the same time different. Because right off the bat, off the opening initial spray this is much darker much deeper much richer definitely definitely um, easy to see that this is an EDP version of the EDT nice I'm gonna give myself another spray because I didn't really Pay much attention when I first sprayed it till it hit my nose. I want to see how much alcohol is in it when you first spray it. Not bad. I mean, my battery is getting low. It's not bad. It's not a lot of alcohol in it at all. Very well made scent. Good job, Calvin Klein. Good job with this one. Good job with this one. I paid $35 for this set. Like I said, I will be selling one of them, either the ED, ED either the 100 mil or the 30 mil. I will probably post on the card. Or if 
you're interested in either one of them, you can always get in there. I will put my email in the description. I like it. I like it. First impression, I like it. And I'll tell you real quick what I get from this fragrance. Clean green. The, the, the crispness and the greenness from the original is way toned down. But this has a little bit more sex appeal. Imagine Eternity Flame and um, Eternity smack dab in one bottle. That's kind of what you get. It's kind of what you get. You don't get as much fresh, as much green, and as much uh, sweet for, uh, as you do from the uh, flame. But you do get a warm fragrance. I think this would be best suited for nighttime wear, evening wear. I think it's a grown man fougere type of scent. Uh, I definitely see the direction that Calvin Klein was trying to go with this one. They're definitely shooting at those niche companies in that style of fragrance. Dare I say this is niche quality? Well, that would depend on performance and projection and all of that. But from my initial reaction, my initial um, first take on this fragrance, I'll say, yeah, I'll say it's a niche quality fragrance all day long from the House of Calvin Klein. And that's just um, proof that you shouldn't give up on the rack stores just yet. You have to look, you have to pick, you have to go outside of your area. Uh, Gardendale is right outside of Birmingham, which is, uh, when you get around Birmingham, there's a lot of affluence. You know, whether you're on the north side, east side, west side, or south side, it's the Birmingham area where you're gonna have issues around it. It's a lot of affluence. Um, but I like this fragrance. Again, my final thoughts on it, I think it's a masculine fragrance. I think this is one that could easily be dressed up. Definitely, to me, more suited for fall, uh, winter, or nighttime, where the original Eternity was more suited for spring and summer. I think this is the complete opposite. Uh, definitely a sexy, romantic fragrance, and I happen to like this fragrance. I like it. If this fragrance performs well, then at $35, it'll be a steal. It'll be a steal all day long. From the house of Calvin Klein, it is Eternity, the EDP. This is one, if you come across it, I think you should pick it up. I've seen that gift set at that same TJ Maxx before, so I know it's been there a while. I just overlooked it the first time that I looked at it and didn't realize it was the EDP until today. And then I was like, it's the EDP. And I looked at the price and was like, I can't leave it for that. I can't leave it for $35. So. But anyway, this is one I think you guys should get and add to your collection from the house of Calvin Klein. One last time, it is Eternity's EDP. Nice, nice. One last time, evening wear. Uh, I think it, you know, maybe dress casual. A nice pair of jeans with some nice shoes, a nice button down, maybe a jacket. I think this is one, not too, too dressy, but I think it's one you, you don't wanna, you don't wanna dress up a little bit and feel a little bit more masculine. Now it's Calvin Klein, so you can wear it with a t-shirt or wherever you want. But I definitely think this is one that leans more towards dressy, yeah. I like it. I like it. If you've been wanting to delve off into that world of modern day masculinity, I think this is a great starting point for you. I'm impressed. I'm impressed. Calvin Klein's Eternity EDP. Guys, I'm going to get off of here. Um, it's Sunday. It's Sunday. So if you haven't entered yourself into the drawing for the uh, Luminous Nights decant giveaway, go ahead and do so. I'm going to uh, Monday night, Sunday night when I get off work, I'm probably gonna sit down and get everybody's names together. And when I get ready to do my video for Monday, I'm gonna draw a name and somebody's gonna win. It just is, it's just a little decant, but it's just a token of appreciation. So anyway, you already know. One last time, Calvin Klein's Eternity. EDP is a winner. I like it. I like it a lot. Anyway, guys, you already know. I love you all. God bless you all. And thank you so much for being the absolute best part of this channel. So, you get off of here, edit it, thumbnail it, and get it up. Until next time, guys. Peace.